Hi, welcome back to my channel. I have the front door open and as you can see the sun's starting to come in so I'm going to try and film how I use these bags for my stationary items. This was box lunch. I think this was Hot Topic box lunch. These I got on sale. This is a little makeup container that I bought many years ago when I was trying it and you got a free pouch. I picked this up at Daiso for about $3 and I love this thing. I love Donald. This little funny guy is um, something that my sister gave me for my birthday. This I purchased from Happy, no, I purchased this from Michael's. And then this was something that I purchased from Disneyland a couple of years ago when I was an annual pass holder. So let's start off with the big guy. Let me get everybody out of the way. Just to show you what I have in here. So it is, two zipper pouches like this. This is something that Beth gave me. Thanks, Beth. I have it in here. In here, I keep some napkins for my watercolor. I have a water brush with water in it, an excellent eraser. And then in here, I keep a lot of page markers. I picked it from Daiso, so you can see I have a lot of uh, stickers from my sister. So I have all of this in here, and you, this is not even, that's a small dent in my small collection <laughs> that I have. And my goal is to try to use that. Now on this side, uh, I keep my watercolor. So this is what I use. So this I used to keep in this bag that I purchased. I'm pretty sure I pur this, purchased this from Hot, Hot Topics online a couple of years ago when the Pooh movie came I out. I purchased this bag to house all my water coloring tins in. So this one is the Classics. I have Odyssey. This is a really nice, pretty bright color. This is Tropical. And yes, this is a lot. And I got these on sale at Amazon but you can see clean. Bruce, Bruce, you okay? Oh, here's another one I got on sale. This one is kind of glittery, which I really like. So that's what this one looked like. Let me show you the swatching. But it's really pretty. So I like using uh, the shimmery after I've watered, after I've watercolored something, right? Using these guys. Then I will go over it with this to give it a, a, a nice shimmer. Is that everybody? One more. Decadent Pies. And then I have water brushes, another napkin. And then on this side, there are two bags that come out like that. So in here, I have a bunch of markers, highlighters, um, some, I think they're gel pens, but they're not colors that I would use. So for now, I'm keeping them in here. Here are more page flags from Daiso. This is from Disney. And uh, I used to carry this guy around too, but now he just sits in here. Let me put everybody back. A nice little chunky guy. So I keep him by my table in the kitchen. So that's that. Again, this is from Hot Topic. And in here, I keep my sticker books. And so in here, I put quite a few of my sticker flakes that I have on these pages. These are ones that I've created, so I put in here. And then more over here, as well as in here. So this I do keep beside me uh, in here. This is something that I purchased from Disneyland. This bag does you know, so if you've never been to Disneyland or, or Walt Disney World or actually any of the Disney parks, in the Haunted Mansion, there are stretching portraits. So that's what these four images are. And you can <laughs> zip this bag up so that you see it like that. And then it stays small on both sides. Like that. But because I'm using it, mine is stretched. And in here, I keep, oh, and then the, the tab part, I don't know what you call it, that little handle for the zipper broke. 
So I put this little pusheen guy that my sister gave me. And actually his tail is starting to fall off, so I need to figure something out for that. But in here I keep track, or I keep all my cords for my iPhone, my iPad, my keyboard. I have a, a cordless portable keyboard, so I have a, a charge for that. But I keep that in here. This guy also goes with me everywhere, from the living room to the kitchen table. To bedroom. Comes with me all the time. See, let's go with this guy. So this is the makeup little bag. But in here, I have more sticky notes. This I purchased from Disneyland. A lot of these are from Disneyland. This came in a set with this. And then this came in another set. Um, from Monsters Inc. This is supposed to be a sushi roll. Let's see, here's another one there. Same set, same set, same set. These came as a set, Disneyland. And this is kind of how I repurpose these bags so that they're not wasted. And on, yep, okay, so that's it for this guy. So I'll put him up here. And then this is uh, something that I purchased from Box Lunch. I am a McDonald's kid, ate it a lot when I was growing up, back in the day. This came with three, I don't know what I did with the other one, with three little bags. And this is, I think, considered a cosmetic bag. So you can see more pins in here. There is more sticky <laughs> notes. So you can see all the little rolls of washi. And this I keep beside me also with these two. So there's this guy. And you know what, let me show you the big one. So this is my big, big one. This is, um, I think they call it, you okay, Bruce Bruce? Yeah. This is, I think they call it a train case. So it's also a makeup cosmetic bag. I'm using it. See, there, there's that really neat ruler handle. I use this to house all my markers. And the markers I purchased from Amazon also on sale. And I think they're Kiritaki. So this is what the inside looks like. So you know what? Let me just kind of scoot everybody aside. So in here are tins that I purchased from Disneyland used to house uh, gummy worms. I used to sell this during Halloween when we were pass holders. So this was 2020. Is that right? It can't be 2020 because 2020 was COVID. Had to be 2019. This one has to be 2018. Because I did purchase this one first and then I purchased this one. But in these two, Alpha Traveler, if you're watching, you were asking me about my sticker books and how many stickers I have. Well, here's a bunch of sticker flakes. sticker flakes <laughs> so a few of these quite a few of these I purchased from a shop on Etsy some of them I purchased from uh, Sanrio uh, at the mall San Anita mall and where else did I get the other ones some of them are ones that I made and then I just cut it up and put them in here like this but guy. in here I love the tin so much I printed stickers and I cut this sticker, I made my own sticker flakes. This is Paper Shire. And so you can see how thick paper, the uh, sticker flakes are in this container. So there's that. The Zig Clean Color brush pins. I love this color. I couldn't find them anywhere. Skin tone is perfect. And so I found this also on sale. You had to buy a minimum of two. So I bought two, four, six. So I bought six of them. Now this is something that I like to use after I finish drawing in pencil. I will sometimes use this to uh, outline it in black. No bleed, uh, fine. I don't know if they make this version anymore. These are the gel pens and Kuretake markers that I have in here. So this is just some of them. And for the color, because I used to keep it in the container that these markers came in, I don't, I can't remember how many in the set that I bought. 
So like a I punch hole through the paper. I punched it through uh, my sticker paper. And then I colored each color so that when you look at the lid, you can see what color it is no matter which side you pick up. So they're all like that, right? So like that, I like that. I just love this bag. This is the handiest bag ever. So if I had to pick out of all of them, I think this one is most useful and can hold a lot. And I like Gus Gus. It's just so cute. So there's that. So let me put him like this. Are we still all in frame? I think we are. Then the last bag I wanted to show you was one that I purchased this past weekend. So you can see how big it is. Uh, again, from my sister. And in here, I keep... Okay, so this is something that I purchased from the Sanrio store a few years ago. But I just like these little containers. Gudetama. Okay, so I'll put that there. This is a clip from Traveler's Notebook. I like carrying this around with me because whatever I'm working on, whether I'm journaling in my A6 diary, I'm working in my um, Hobonichi Cousin that I'm using as my writing journal in my Traveler's Notebook, when I'm writing ideas for my stories, I like using the clip to clip things down. So we'll put him there. And let me go a little faster because the sun's starting to really come through. Here's the pencil that I like to use. Uh, my husband, surprised me with a pen that he purchased from work. So in here I have all the ink cartridges and stuff that I need. You okay? Uh, that I need for this pen as well as the Hobonichi pen. So here's, and then I put the black rubber on it. I took it off of another Hob Hobonichi pen that broke and I slipped it onto here. And then I like using these two yellow gel pens I like to keep track of the weather. It's when I draw the sun, color it in. This is what I use. This bag also goes with me everywhere. And um, since I keep the A5, my journaling, doodling book next to my bed, I love having this around and carry it around because then the pencil is in here. I don't like keeping the pencil. I tried keeping the pencils uh, in the zip cover. And it just, I was worried about damaging the cover so now I don't do that so we'll put Donald down there and then just one last thing I wanted to show you that I picked up from Timu is this <laughs> it is it's not a5 I don't know what size this thing is but it's really big I had hoped that it was smaller so I could fit it with my cousin but I'm in, in here I keep all my uh, magazine cutouts that I may use on a page when I have nothing to say. Or if I just want to decorate, here's a big page of Cheetos. So I wanted to show you that. This is really cute. So I, if this thing came in a three pack, I'm only using one. So that's what that looks like. So that is a quick look of, well, it's not a quick look, but it's a look of the pouches and bags that I'm using to house most of my stationary items, once again, even though I have, you know, sticker books and buckets of washi tape. This is housing like my markers, things that I carry around. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. Subscribe if you like to see generally after the pin videos. Have a great weekend. I'll see you next week. Bye.